Hello everyone, Jack here from Second Gear and welcome yourselves back to Darksiders 2. So we are still up in this first tower. I actually just spawned up here so because we ended off right down at the bottom by where that other light beam thing was. But we are rocking the Angel of Death set which looks absolutely beautiful. Plus we got a rocking eagle on our shoulder. And I see you up there. Yes I do, I know that glow anywhere. Except it looks like there's, it's, it's going to be a new kind of stone. Mystic? Yes, it's a mystic. Oh, thank God. But last episode, we actually did get Voidwalker, which is the portal device. So, happy days on that one. So, I'm not in, not entirely sure what I'm meant to do with it. Not a single freaking clue. Maybe i got to put one portal there. And one portal on the inside, I think. Perhaps. I'm not entirely sure. In fact, it's not even I'm not entirely sure. I have no freaking clue. So, chuck one there. No. No, this this simply will not... Aha! So we're going to have to find a way to open up that grate. And then charge one. Stick it there. And I'm not happy to know if that's charged or not. I don't know. You know, we, we can just leave it. It doesn't really matter. Well, it does, but it doesn't at the same time. You know what I mean. Okay, so we need to... I'm guessing when we split our souls, we actually... Oh, okay, okay, hold on. I'll explain it in a second. And that's now. So when we split our souls right here, which I'm going to do right now, one of these opens up the grate. And the other one opens up the gate. You know, the gate that we need to be sprung-loaded through. So we drop this through there and form... Form... I would be correct on this matter. Wonderful stuff. That's just great for me. Okay. Right. Now we can ascend the tower even more. With its weird-ass corruption water, that's probably going to kill me the second I even touch it. So let's just not touch it, eh? Probably the best thing to do. Alrighty. So this is pretty obvious what's going to happen here. So we've got to chuck one there. Do not touch the water, for the love of God. Okay. We need to find a way to get round here. And down there. There we go. So now chain lightning. And now it's going to purify all the water. The question is, what way do we go? Left or right? I would say the way we're currently facing down the aqueduct. Because then we can destroy that corruption and create a shortcut. Wow. Sorry. I'm an idiot. That's the way we need to go. So, I'm going to have a look and see what's this way. Simply because you know they always stick stuff in the place that you're not meant to be going. That makes sense. And in this instance, it seems I am incorrect, which is fine. You know what? I like heaven. Heaven's a nice place, except that unnerves me quite a bit. The fact that heaven is so easily... Okay. I was about to say, the fact that heaven's so easily corruptible. But has anyone actually looked at religion? Jesus, that was nearly a mistake. Oh, dear. It's funny because it's overly true. And no one can even deny it. Or you can, but you're still going to be wrong at the end of the day. Which is unfortunate for you, but still. You may believe in whatever you wish to believe in. Such as life as a human. At least you're not an animal. At least then you're not butchered for meat. And no, 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 no. I'm not saying that veganism is, is that correct. Vegan or vegetarian is better. Not by a long shot. But still. You know. Just let people live and do whatever they want. Yes, we're overfishing. Yes, we're over eat. What? What in bloody hell was that? Okay, grab this. What, is this now a timed bomb? Yep, I guess not. Did that destroy all of it? Yes! Alright, sweet. I was wondering what that was actually for. Question, can I climb this? Apparently I can. Da, 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 da. That's one of those weird electrical things we saw uh, last episode. Let my hammer get rid of the corruption, you vengeful bastard. You're going to make me pull out redemption, aren't you? You little prick. Oh, no, you fell down there. Okay, never mind. Oh, yeah. Sorry, 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 sorry. But in case you missed last uh, the last episode, we've got our first level in the Reaper's Storm. It looks like it's going to be so <laughs> goddamn powerful. I'm not going to show you it now because it's going to be a race of wrath. And a, race, a waste of wrath. And, yeah, there's no point wasting it. So now we've got one side of the place purifying. Now we just need to get the other side, and we should be able to get into the next area. Can... Go away. Please. I've had enough of vengeful spells. Okay. 
There you go. You wanted a play ball? There's going to be one more. Actually, two more, I'm reckoning. No, just one? Okay, that's fine. That's for me to kill. That's not a bad thing either. Because killing these piddly ass enemies is more of a nuisance than it is worth it. If that makes sense whatsoever. Kind of butchered it, but uh, it's okay. Alright, we're going to need a key. We've got some corruption. Hello, the exact place where the skeleton key is going to be in. Everyone knows it because we already found our dungeon map, so there's nothing else that can actually be there. Let's drop down here, shall we? Hopefully I hasn't just screwed myself. Ooh, purple gauntlets. They're not bad. Well, especially for... I cannot. Arcane, but still. Right, I'm not going to uh, use a bit of raft so we can pick up that potion because we're probably going to be using a bit of Reaper Storm in this area, so I'd rather save all of the wrath we can possibly get. What's actually in our hot bar? You know what? We can get rid of Teleport Slash. So if I bind that to... Oh, what? That's already bound to B. Or bound to A, even. Oh, wait, no, that's Soul Splitter. Okay, bind that to B. We haven't got Harvest hotkeyed anymore. What's bloody wrong with me? You know what? We very rarely use Soul Splitter, so I'm going to put Harvest where Soul Splitter is. Because Harvest is kind of something I love to use. Oh dear. It seems that we're going to be put inside of a trap. What's about you get those winged bitches again? Hmm. Wait for it. Someone new. Okay. Corrupted champion. You don't seem that smart. Alright, let's see what your health pool's like. Oh dear god, you have quite a large health pool. Wait, we reached level 20. We could actually use our um, Scepter of the Deposed King right now. Problem is, it's kind of trashy, like base damage wise. And I'd rather, because we're not built for arcane, I'd rather not, um, you know, accept less DPS when we focus on strength and defense. You know, it's that old chestnut. Come on, kill him. Kill him. Thank you very much. Spellbound Buckler. Alright. You know what? Come over here. Come on. Come over here. Come on. Unstoppable. Reaper Storm. Let's see how much damage this does. Not a lot. Oh dear. Okay. Uh, I might have been mistaken about Reaper Storm. Oh, we just gotta wait. Oh, we just gotta wait till it's a higher level. Which is most likely. You know what? Just yeah. There you go. Oh dear God, no. We're nearly dead. All right. Didn't focus on my health enough. This champion doesn't actually want to fight, it seems. Which is rather odd, considering he is... Oh, an agent of corruption. We're going to have to use our last health potion. Damn it. Can you just not? Can you just die? Thank you. Okay. Really, really freaking wish that uh, Reaper Storm would have done more damage there, but... Eh, you can't have everything. Right, there's nothing else in here for us to get. It doesn't look like this is going to be a trap. Oh, I don't like that thing. It creeps me out. What are you... Go away. God damn vengeful spirits. No. Mad spirits. What did I just say? Ooh, hello, page of the Book of the Dead. Number two, I think, of chapter three? Yep, number two of the third chapter. Wonderful stuff. We're getting quite a lot of it now. Yeah, I'm just gonna... Yep. Just gonna hop down here. Aha! Void Walker. Womp. So there must have been another portal. Oh, come on! Alright, none of them are champions, so that's good for me. Don't attack. Just just die. Okay? You know it's going to happen. I really wish I had some claws right now. How about you kneel before me? Because frankly, I've been every one of you sorry excuses for angels. And it hasn't exactly been a hard job. Okay, yes, it has had its ups and its downs. As with every war slash fight is going to. Right, never mind. So now we have a little hook shot over there. Is that everything? Is, uh, okay, I think I have to get back up there to a certain spot to be able to use Void Walker again. Or use Void Walker in the place we actually need it. So now we hop over here. We do a little wall jump. Wall jump! Thank you. All right. Where is this going to take us? So we've got a lever. No spirits. Okay. No spirits. Please. Holy crap. Bugger. I was about to say, thank you. But spoke too soon. One more. One more. Thank you. I don't know what, what happened to my voice. I just... Oh, Jesus. I forgot. 
enemies that are incredibly weak we can insta-kill with just by pressing B. We didn't need to keep switching to goddamn redemption. Okay, so that opens that one up. So that does that. The question is, where does it need to go to? Alright, let's just have a look and see what this switch does. Okay, never mind, never mind, never mind. I already know what we need to do here. Uh, right, soul splitter, just as I take it off with hotkey. Oh, of course. Right, let's put it around. So that pulls that one down. And now the other one's going to pull this wall down, I hope. Oh no, it's going to pull both of them down. Okay. Huh. Not sure what to do now. <laughs> yeah, I have no idea. So that one raises that one up. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay, 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 okay. I understand. So we've got to pull this one down. You can let go of yours. But we can't. Because what I'm thinking is that we need to use Void Walker to launch ourselves through. Because there's one down here. Wait, that's not going to work. No, it's not. Damn it. Alright, scratch that idea. Oh, hello, Relic. I didn't see you there. It's a rare one, too. Cool. Cool. Alright, if we open this one up then, and then we can just have a look and see what's through this side. Okay, let go of that one. We really chose a very poor placement for the stone statue to be in. So what about if I switch now, let go of this one, which should raise death higher up. And we push this one round, for some reason. Wait, push, thank you! Right, no switch. Hmm. Damn. Why can I not aim downwards? I know we're not going to be able to make this jump, but fuck it. Nope. Okay, let's choose a better placement for death. I was about to say, I'm a goddamn idiot, but nope, it's not quite solved yet. Alright, let's split our soul. Unless we're meant to... No. That wouldn't work. We've got to use this ball to do something, but I'm not sure what kind of corruption we need to clear to actually... Like, I don't know what corruption we need to move. Right, that's nothing. There's nothing up there. Alright, let's split our souls. Nope, not... Bloody void. Nope. This. Thank you. So we pull the left one, that left one goes down. But if we pull the right one, that right one goes down. Huh. So if we pull the right one and try and use Void Walker to put a portal onto that one, then can I portal through a portal to be able to portal another surface? I know that just sounded so weird, but still. Oh wait, what am I doing? I need to go around here. Void Walker that one. So now... I didn't actually... Aha! Hello. So now if we look through this one... Wait. Let go of that. So that raises that one up. Alright. Then we do this. This works. Wait, does it? Okay, okay. Hold on, hold on, hold on. There's no downward facing one, is there? Okay, so now we need to drop the left barrier so that we can slingshot death through there to open the gate. I'm pretty sure that's what we need to do. Right, let's try it. I was right. Wonderful. So now we should be able to please open the gate. Oh, thank you. If that wasn't the end of the puzzle, I would have been so annoyed. Soul Splitter. I love this, um, this new armor set. It looks so cool. And I love the book bound at the back. Nope. That's kind of... That's a, that's a cool way to kill him, though. I think. It looks cool. Right. Doesn't look like any more vengeful spirits. But we are going to have a little bit of a fight on our hands here. New whip. Okay. Well, let's get things started then, shall we? Please. No! Stupid, bloody nuisance of a vengeful spirit. Die. 
Thank you. Pauldrons, they're crap. We already know this. Right, can I just... Can you just insta-kill him? Pauldrons. Pauldrons. Can you stop looting stuff, Jack, while, you know, you're getting attacked and killed? Right, one more. Oh. Bye. <laughs> I guess. If you really want to just jump off the edge so quickly, fair play. Whatever floats your goat. Skeleton key, wonderful. So now we can use the bombs to get uh, through here, then straight up into the door, and everyone goes home happy. But what was with the uh, pylon then? I'm going to call it a pylon because it is a transfer of energy. So that... Stop. Just stop it. Nope. I'm going to insta-kill all of you, so just, just don't pop up. After I fix everything, you're not really going to have a need to be vengeful anymore, correct? Granted, that is probably wrong. But Aha, I know what the pylon's for, so we can link it into here. I am an idiot. So now we go fourth one. Just don't. Just don't. Okay, so now we do this. We go around here. There's the pylon, I'm sure, is just downstairs. E yes, it is. Now we go fourth one. And there we go, we've cleansed all the water. Beautiful. Look at it, it's all pure and lovely again. I wonder what heavenly water would taste like. Would it taste like, like normal tap water or would it be something special? You would hope for something special, but who knows? This screams to me like there's something special over here. It leads straight over there. I don't know. Alright, all we can do is try. Come on, don't... Go away! Stupid, vengeful spirits! Okay, jockey. Ooh, blue chest piece. They're kind of trashy. That's okay. I'm not even mad. Blue scythes. Raw damage. Unfortunately, I'm not going to put them on because the ones we currently have are possessed. Which are infinitely better, even though they are of lower quality. Alright, so where... So we need to go back up there to then take the other route down over there. It's an electric guy again. Wait a second. Or should I go through here first? You know what? I'm going to go through here first, just so we don't need to worry about having to come back that way again. We can just come straight back into the main room. Because all it's going to show us is that... Oh, look! The crisp... Shit! Really? Really? Please don't lock me in here. Why don't... Oh, damn it. Alright. Your attack versus mine. Who's going to win? I think the guy with the big off hammer. Right, am I, am I free to leave now? Please? No, battle music still rages on. Do I need to drop down there? Ah, here we go. Alright, let's just hope after I beat all of these angels into submission, we're going to be allowed to leave back through that door. I would like to say yes. But unfortunately... Okay. There we go. Alright, quick. He can be executed. Beautiful. I just don't know. I understand that some things even outdate death, the horseman. But still, you can't honestly think it's a smart idea to go up against death. I mean, really. Weren't you raised to be a bit smarter than this? No. Yes. Go away. You bloody pests. There's going to be one more. Oh, no. Okay. Fair enough. So this drops down here, but why would I want to go down here? Oh, that looks like a graphical glitch if I've ever seen one. A boatman coin. Okay. Worth it so far. But, question, where the hell am I? Well, not anywhere we've been before. I think we've gone a little bit further than where we should have been. Because we still need to go back up that other way and search the right, the left side. Oh, vengeful spirit. Just you wait a second. You just wait right freaking there. Come here. Alrighty. You know what? No, no, no. I'm going to go back. I'm going to go back. Just going to go back to the top of the tower. It's where we should be right now. Or is, no, this is where we should be, but that's where I want to be because there's loads of stuff to search and all that kind of stuff. 
What about all of those little caverns that have all the tainted water there? Can't be nothing there, otherwise what's the point of making it, like, enterable? There is no reason. There's going to be something there. Okie dokie. I haven't noticed... Oh, wait, yes, never mind. I was going to say, because this uh, set of armor is built solely around uh, defense and health regen and wrath regen. And I was just saying, I was just thinking that I haven't actually seen our health regen whatsoever. But it must be. It has to be. And we also have a massive increase to our health too. I would rather have a massive increase to just raw damage. Simply because it is raw damage. Okay, I'm not even going to waste time. I'm just going to go back up to the top. Because it is only here and we're just going to go traverse down the other side. Okay. Bum, 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 Please don't tell me I'm wrong here. Please tell me there's something that's worth coming back here to. Because look, there's that little... Oh, God. There's that little cave just down there in that pool. So far, obviously, there's nothing. Now, the question is, do I just follow this along? You know, we'll follow it along if I can't see anything, like, spawn in at the end of here. Which I can't. Okay, we're going to drop down here then. Go through this tunnel. Whoop. Now, pray tell. What would be in here? Nomad's Gnome. A mysterious gnome statue left by Nomad. One out of four. Okay. That rings a bell. Why does that ring a bell? I'd have to boot, boot up my PS3 to be able to see what what exactly, what kind of bell it rings. Is there no shortcut up here? Oh, god damn it. Okay. Well, that was short-lived. There were two caverns. They connected to each other, and they gave us a weird-ass deathly gnome. All right. Fair enough. Can't really complain. Because I remember there being something secret in this game which gives you a special weapon if you manage to find them all. But I think that was the I think that was the stones, like, you know, the power stone, resistance stone, um, mystic stone. I think there's probably going to be one more kind of stone because resistance stones come from heaven. Uh, power stones come from the kingdom of the dead. Mystic stones come from tri stone, and we've still got to go through hell, quite literally. So I'm guessing there's going to be one more kind. So that's four, four kinds of stones, which I think make up one awesome set of scythes. Ones that increase your resistance, your strength, your defense, and just the raw damage of it. Or no, I think that's strength. Or it could just be a insanely good set of scythes. Who knows? We're just going to have to wait and see, unfortunately. Unless you could just look it up, but then what's the point? Yeah. I never tend to use walkthroughs or anything like that. Unless it's something which has boosted the, uh, the episode length to over 50 minutes, i.e. finding the Tomb of the Kingdom of the Dead. Even though I know I've seen it before, but I just couldn't freaking remember where it was. But never mind. But I mean like full, complete, spoiler, spoiler full walkthroughs. Like the catalogs you get with virtually every single RPG. I know you're not going to stick around, so just go away. Alright, well we've got to set this up first, so probably charge portal there. Up you go, what are you doing? And a standard portal. Wait, I want to redo this one. Oh god, it actually does fire out. That's kind of cool. This is going to launch us clean off the cliff, isn't it? No. Okay, so it only acts like a charge portal for exits. Alright, I'm going to go ahead and guess. Thwomp. Now, there's nothing to actually climb up there with. So I'm guessing that's climbing back. Uh, we're going to need this portal, though. Is that, like, something to... Nope. <laughs> Looked like Sonic for a second there. Wait, then where the hell... Is this meant to go? Ah. There we go. So now we can wall run. That really confused me. I thought I just launched myself to, the, to my death again. Oh, dear God. Come here, Bunkman Coin. That's 42, people. That's 42. So now, if we chuck one there, and one down there, can I just wall run into it? Okay, and what does that do? Okay, new plan. Can I just... Right, we need a charge portal here. Okay, 
Okay. Let's just reset this. I don't know why I have to charge it every time. Right. Charged. Charged. Alright, both of them are charged. So this should launch us. Clean out, and there we go. Damn portal. If I never played Portal, I would have probably struggled a hell of a lot more with Void Walker. But because Portal is such a goddamn awesome game, if you've never played it, you're missing out. It's probably like only £5 on Steam at the moment, so... You know, you can always go, go and buy it. As well as Half-Life while you're there. Ah, we finally meet. Psychophant? 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 Alright, you're stuck. Advantage. Damn. Alright, we need to be quick up. Oh, dear God, he has a set of claws. Alright, well, I have a set of scythes. See how this works? There's more. Another scythe. Mine. Oh, dear God. Holy crap, look at our health. Nope, let me use harvest. Do you see how fast that's... that? Why, did, why was that regenerating so quickly? Nope. Let me use Harvest. Nope, there you go. Hit him! Thank you. Alright, so he's going to do... Why are there so many of you pricks? Okay. Alright, one hit. Flomp. Right, I think there's only one more left. Yep, there's only one more left. And he killed me. No, he hasn't. No, he hasn't. Health potion. Use it. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. My god, the range on these neat whacks. Alright, here we go. Just keep stunning him. One hit. Thank you. Jesus. Alright, I wish these guys would have stayed away now. Can you stop damage over timing me? If that's even a word or a term, I don't even know. God damn it, it's like half one in the morning. This is very, very... You. This is very, very bad. Might be wondering why. Well, if you are. Because I've still got to do a stream tonight, too. Well, not got to. I want to do a stream tonight, too. The problem is, it's half one in the morning. Oh, dear. I sense an all-night and sleeping all day tomorrow. I hope it's not going to come to that, but it probably is. Alrighty. Nope. Get out of here. Annoying little spirits. More health potions, always accepted. Thank you very much. Alright, so we've got a Void Walker portal here. We have Page of the Book of the Dead. That's number 3 out of 10. Nothing around here. Alright, so just to save time, I'm just going to do that now. Because you know we're going to have to link it at some point. Oh, okay. I already see what I think they want me to do. I remember this. I remember this. So, we got to come over here. Got to rotate this, which then rotates the maze. There we go. And then we got to let go of it. So, we've got to walk him in. Ah. Ah. Okay. Okay, I understand. We put the concrete statue in the wrong place. Alright, so if I jump over there, I can't push it any further. Damn. We're going to have to redo this. And then that pushes it back in. Alright, so if we do it over here, that green definitely fell off the ledge. Ooh, didn't see there's a space down here. Alright, well first, in case I go out of uh, the distance of the soul splitter, I might as well put this out first. Because obviously we're going to have to do it again. Okay, so that's there. Now, what's down here that you don't want me to find? If anything at all. I think this is just some random ledge. I don't think there's any point to it. Nope. I don't think so. That's okay. Not everything has to have treasure. Even though I would like it to all have treasure. No sweet ass backflips, please. Not right now. Okay. So, round of... Whoops. It's a pull, not a push. How many times have you made that mistake in life? My guess is quite a lot, because I do it all the time, too. Right, can you just grab and... Nope. Apparently we can't, like, launch it. Apparently I can't even move it now. Oh, I can move it this way. Can you just go in? Oh, thank you. 
Now there has to be a bomb around here somewhere. No. Just no. I like the look of Purple Death. It looks cool. There's a vengeful spirit down here. That uh, This one's going to... I see you. I see you, I see you, I see you. Power Stone. Power Stone. I was right. Okay. So now if we let go of this... Uh, exit the Soul Splitter. Close this door. Yep, that door's still going to be open. How am I meant to get over there? Alright, there's like a little aqueduct thing over there. Alright, well, we're going to have to split our soul again, it seems. Alright, round and round and round we go. So that does this one. Huh. Hmm. Not entirely sure how this is going to work. Alright, go away. Thank you. Hello, Soul Arbiter Scroll that had no symbol around it. You sneaky little prick. Right, nothing around there. We have a portal down here. No shit. Question is... That goes to there. So if I make death release off of that, that's going to spin that round there, causing the lightning to go that side. Or do I need to hop over... Th okay, hold on, hold on. I'm probably going to go a very, very long-winded way about this. Wait, so if that one's there... So I need to go back over here. I need to go down to this portal. Go through it. Put a portal on that side. Go through that. Or I'm going to trap myself and screw everything up. You son of a bitch! Great. Oh wait, I can just do it this way. Alright. Could have probably done that from all the way over there. But still, it's okay. It's just... Oh, shit. Didn't think this through. Did not think this through. Oh dear. Oh wait, no, 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 no. It's okay. It's salvageable. Don't throw me. You son of a bitch, you threw me. So I need to get over there. I can't make that jump, can I? Wait, if I just cancel out this portal, then cancel out that one. Now this portal has to go back down on the other side. Oh my god, this is so confusing. <laughs> Even though I'm most likely making it more confusing than it actually needs to be. Can't wall run. Oh, damn it. I think I might have fucked myself. No, I haven't. I spawn right down here. Right, so now we put that one there. Now we're going back through, do the puzzle. And then that beam of light's going to hit this one, so then we can pile on it round. Oh, Jesus Christ. That means I'm going to have to pull this round again. Oh. Okay. No, it's not going to work. It is not going to work. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Would have worked if I wasn't such a dick with my placement of the bloody stone statue. Alright, open that. I've probably done this the longest possible way. And someone who's, like, really freaking good at this game is probably thinking, you're a bloody idiot. Okay, cancel it. Please hop back up. Alright, soul splitter, just don't fuck this up, okay? I'm just thinking, did I put a portal back there? I did. Wait, no, he's meant to. Okay, never mind, never mind. I nearly just made a really bad mistake. I was about to cancel it. We need that portal there. All we need to do is deactivate soul splitter. Turn it back around this way. Spin that round so that the beam can hit it and then charge that one. And then we move from there. So round and round and round we go. Lovely. Question is, does it get... No, nope, it's charged. It's fully charged. So now that one goes to that one. And then that destroys the corruption. Alright, so we're working here. We're working. Question is, now where do we go? So I think we've got to... Alright. Alright, I think I understand. So now we have an open... You know what? I think we're going to have to pick this up next episode because I just looked at the time and we're somewhat out of time, especially considering that this is going to be a trap and a fight. 
So yeah, we're gonna have to pick this up next episode, guys. Sorry that we're stopping halfway through a puzzle, but hey, you gotta you gotta keep a track on that video length, otherwise you're gonna be in a little bit of trouble. But anyway, hopefully you are, you guys are still enjoying the series with our Deathly Adventures with Death himself in the definitive edition of Dark Siders 2. That is so many. So many deaths in one goddamn sentence. If you are, be sure to show some love down below by dropping a like. Let me know what you think about the remastered version of this game in the comment section down below if you've played it before. Or if you've never seen it, what's your overall impression of the game so far? Frankly, I still think it looks pretty damn good for the age of it. And it's got a pretty damn good story. And it's just... I think it's just a solid game all in all. Except for one thing. Running. There's no sprint feature. In an open world game, you kind of need a running feature. Otherwise, it takes a while. I know you, I know you have a horse... But just running through corridors would help a hell of a lot. But yeah, let me know about that stuff in the comment section down below if you could be so kind. And finally, guys, if this is the kind of content that you do enjoy to watch, be sure to subscribe to the channel to be able to keep up to date with all of our series and streams and what have you. And if you're new here, we actually stream every Wednesday, Friday, and Sunday, as long as nothing gets in the way, which normally it doesn't. But yes, so there's always that. As well as I always let you guys know before we go live for uh, within about an hour, so you guys can get your shit together and get over to the stream to have some fun, have a laugh, and have a chat. But yeah, thank you all for watching, guys, and until next time, I shall see you all later.